Hello and welcome back to my channel. So today we're talking about a fish that has a unique elegance and grace that you just don't see in many other fish. Of course, I'm talking about the black ghost knife fish. With its out of this world swimming behavior, the black ghost knife fish uses its large anal fin to propel itself forwards and backwards. And it makes it look like it's actually traveling on rails. The wave-like movements can actually leave you mesmerized for hours. I know when I was filming this fish, I couldn't stop staring at how it was moving its fins. Now being a knife fish, they're actually related to the electric eel and they possess the electric organs and receptors. Now these are primarily used for navigation and communication. So have no fear, these fish won't be shocking you or your family anytime soon. Now this particular large specimen in this video is currently available for sale at the Water Garden which is my local fish shop and that is based in southwest England so be sure to check out their Facebook and pay them a visit if you're interested in keeping this fish. I'll put a link in the description of this video so you can find them. So black ghost knife fish can reach a size up to 50 centimeters in length that's 19 inches so it's by no means a small fish, despite most being available in stores around 6 to 10 centimeters. Now despite their large size, black ghost knife fish are relatively peaceful, and they prefer to keep to themselves, and assuming something can't fit in their mouth, they will not harm your other tank mates. Black ghost knife fish are quite shy fish when first introduced to an aquarium, however, after time, they are known to become quite tame, and can be seen even eating from their owner's hands. Now, as we've mentioned, black ghost knife fish get large and to house them appropriately for long term, you're going to want to have an aquarium of a minimum 450 litres, which is 100 US gallons. And as with any fish that if you buy it small, sure, you can keep them initially in a small aquarium of around 50 gallons, but we'll need to consider an upgrade as they start to grow up to the 8 to 10 inch mark. Now, in terms of water parameters for the black ghost knife fish, they're not really that fussy and they'll thrive in a hardness of up to 16 degrees and a pH between 6.0 and 7.5. So, although the black ghost knife fish is a large fish, it is actually considered to be what we call a macro predator. And that means unlike its relatives such as the clown knife fish or the African knife fish, black ghost knife fish actually have a relatively small mouth and typically would eat small fish and insects in the wild. So, when keeping them in the aquarium, foods like sinking carnivore pellets and frozen foods such as bloodworm are very good staples for their diet. Now, as I've mentioned, when it comes to tank mates, black ghost knife fish are relatively friendly fish. But you're going to want to avoid small fish like neon tetras, small barbs. But good tank mates for a black ghost knife fish would consist of fish such as earth eater cichlids, sometimes referred to as geophagus. Angelfish, medium sized gourami such as the opaline gourami, and even large rainbow fish. I, b I have believed that black ghost knife fish are a great fish to keep in the aquarium, and they're one of those feature fish that you could show your friends and family when they visit. They don't always show themselves, but when they do, they sure leave a mark. Now, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, feel free to pop some comments below. Have a great day as always and I'll see you in the next video.